these are the bones that are uh, from the thoracic cage, which is our ribs and also sternum. Um, in human, there are normally uh, about um, 12 pairs of the ribs, and it is divided into two types, which is a uh, false rib and also true ribs. For your information, um, these ribs and sternum also categorized in the same, which is um, a flat bone. It is because of uh, this flat bone will act as a protection for the organs such as the heart. Okay, next. So we can see here this is a true weight and this is a part of false weight. This is a floating weight and this you can see the zephyr process and also the costal cartilage. Body of stinum here, you can see the body of stinum here, and also this is a manual beam. Okay, did you know what is the difference between the true width and also the false width? Um, the true width is actually the first seven widths that attach to the sternum in at the front part, which is um the the superior part of the rib cage. Okay, for the first rib, it is the lower of five of five ribs that is not directly connected to the stomach. Okay, that is the difference between that. Okay, next we can see this is a sternum, which is a anterior view of the stomach. We can see here the jugular notch, clavicular notch here, jugular notch, manubrium, sternal angle, and the body, and also the body notch as a gladiolus. At the end of this, thing, we can see here this is a type of process. This is the sternal joint. Actually, jugular notch also known as a suprasternal notch. Um, it is located at the T2 and T3. Uh, for, the, for your information, in radiography, it is used as a 